Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play The Lord of the Rings! The Third Age, I'm your game master Darius. Last we left off, we... Might have missed a little bit of treasure down here. We'd also face off against a... Mighty foe, in the form of a freaking goblin. Was not something I was expecting. But I was also not expecting a rematch against the Watcher in the water, so... You know... Just an average day in freaking uh, Middle Earth. Now, at some point, I'm gonna remember that I need to heal people as well. Uh, we are gonna do some leadership. Team building! Yeah, we finally actually just picked up the goddamn weapon of the orcs. Oh, God damn, I hate this chair. Yep, can't use those. Dwarving Glyph. Uh, let's have you taunt the foe. Because you are so far the healthiest one. Gladrill. Ah, already taunting, so might. You know, I probably should have just, you know what, it's fine. All the king's foil. So it's not that we're crafting it in order to use it right, uh, right there and then. We're crafting it in order to... Well, damn. Oh, we're missed. We're crafting it in order to, you know, use it for another time. That said, it still takes AP. Ooh, good crit. Uh, a good leader restores the AP of his allies. So that he might smash. Yeah, I won't lie. I'm still a little bit thrown off about the um, ooh, ooh. Uh, still a little bit thrown off about the whole. God, what am I? Three party limit. Three, okay. Three party member limit in the combats. Attack more often. Go forth and slaughter. Uh, da -da, Valor. Now I know that this is going is not going to kill you right off, but 414 HP is a good start. I really should have used a skill. Get a little bit of AP back for our resident mage. Our mage just not a mage by name. You so tanky. I can't complain because it means that you are granting me more SP. Just goddamn, sir. Boom, boom. Maybe I should lead with the the one that makes it so as everyone gains more attack power first. Elven steel brain branches. Of course, it's Elven. Let's see, nine more armor. Again, why the hell is the El oh okay? 
I guess it makes sense because I'm pretty sure that the elf would be the one to have basically all the mithril. Kind of need it with, with them being all gangly. Every single one of these is going to have a warger goblin, huh? Let's start with Company Mike. Shall we? Oh, Fellowship Grace. Man, they sure gave these goblins some faces. Hey, learned Hue Warmer. I don't know what Hue did to their armor. Excuse me. Alright. Nope. Uh, what's this one? I can't use it. I can't use it, therefore I can't look at it. Them's the law. Ow. Stun strike? Ah, crap. Alright. That's going to have to be something I need to look forward to. Alright, oh, Hue Armor. What was the armor of a foe? Yeah, it's probably not a bad idea to use. wonder how long Stunned works. Did I say wonder how long? I mean, I hope it doesn't last that long. Well, at least it gives Had a bunch of chances to just kind of do his thing. Rawr. Prepared to see that face of victory a lot. Cracked Elfstone of Fire Protection. Who's got the shittiest fire? Okay, really, I should give you the water stone. And you the water. Fire. I know what I'm trying to say. Alright, you get fire. You lose your water. And though we're not facing anything that has water... I'd rather be safe than sorry. Alright, was that all of them? Because I know I checked out this one. Yep. Like no, none of these have another surprise watcher in the water. I think the only one we've not checked out... We only missed that because it wasn't glowy. I suppose I should give Barathor a little bit of something. Action points. Uh, we're good. I'll have Idriel use the one to drain action points in combat. After a little bit of buff. Or I can just hit the save point. Yeah, yes, save over that one. Thank you. Doom game. Don't travel back yet. Room three of seven. I. Okay, so it's not just that I am... I'm not missing them so much as there's literally just jumping around. I know it not, but these wretched orcs are trapped within these halls. They hide from the sun, but more do they fear their new master. They awaken him in times of great need, yet always fall victim to his terrible wrath. Seriously, game, you're hyping this shit up a lot. 
I better actually be facing off against the goddamn Balrog. Which. Alright. Can't bring out the crossroads. You have found our campsite. That is very good indeed. You have also found Boromir, for he has traveled with us since Rivendell. Have you considered Berathor precisely why you were compelled to seek him? Many that live deserve death. Some that die deserve life. Do not be too eager to deal out death and judgment. Even the very wise can see all ends. Well, now that just makes me confused. Almost as confused as the placement of these things. Because if I were to... I, I kind of feel... Okay, this is where they got all twisty-turny. Let's go this way, then. <laughs> Let's go the ways that they didn't go in the movies. I right, got a couple of runes to collect after all. Hello, treasure. Four oh seven. Quite literally, just all the experience points. Shut up, phone. Hmm. That's the save point. Suspicious of the save point. Rather suspicious of the save point. Some sort of strong fight to be had. War of a day. Okay, first off, was that axe or ash? It was ash. Well, I have to see what War of a Nail does. Uh, just his piercing damage, puts enemy to sleep. Oh, you'll. Removes melee range and spirit immobilization. Immobilizing. Alright. Hi, Sauron. Oh, hi, wargs. Glen Shadow. A lot ally negative effects removed. That's a pretty bitchin' one. No, I'm only really doing this in the usual way that I do things. Oh, this one restores action points. Alright. And then get attacked the butt load. That's a lot of a lot of attacks you just did, thank you. Um, counter argument. Ooh. Oh, only one? Oh, volley. Might not have been a great use of, uh, all that motivation. Counter argument, though. Other gherkin. Uh, that's Alagost. Uh, let's see. Nine more armor, some dexterity and speed. And new change of clothes. Alrighty. Uh, let's put your strength up a little bit more. Really should focus on spirit for him for a bit. Then, as his strength is already 50 freaking one. There's your spirit at 50. I think that's good. How can we open this? 
We will have to unlock Moria's secrets first. Yes, before the goblins trap us here. Hmm. I mean, I see treasure. I'm... Real talk, too. I am so glad that the treasure that they have in the game is illuminated. Because while some of it is very clear... Through in water... Uh, and you can see it quite clearly, even from a distance. Sometimes, you're just rounding a corner, kind of miss it. Not yet found all seven rooms. Okay. A return here with all seven rooms. Bruh. Oh god, more wards. Really need to think more on what to do when there's so many wards. <clears throat> Uh, let's just do a good old cleave. Good lord, that is nasty. Oh. I play counterattacks. Okay. Valor. Oh, it goes twice. Awesome. Leadership. That said, I do need to test out his whole thing. Look at a loud one. Are you? And then cleave it. Probably should get some healing on. Ooh, yep. Need to test this, because he's currently got 189. Alright, so he uses... Effectively uses 60, but he gets it back, which is good. Because we're going to need it. The did I'll rage furnish off this one over here. Yeah, okay. That, that region is just really stupid good. I can deny it no longer. It is good. God damn, these guys are menaces. I suppose, though, this is their way of making it so as if you just want to go through the game, that you can simply decide, hey, less AP by, like, a point, Less health, but way more damage. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a lot more. A lot, a lot better. <laughs> more? Better. Better, better. Speed of 29. He's not slow, just needs more damage. Anyways. Ah, I feel like I've said a billion thoughts and I haven't been able to get any of them out. Point is the chests are good because they get you get to see them better because they're all glowy glowy when you get close to them. Which is just good in general. Oh yeah, the way through the other way would be a lot harder to get through now, wouldn't it? Yuck. All the bridges are out. There's a bunch of goblins and orcs. And of course, a giant freaking demon. Depending on how long that fight's been going on.
Um, oh yeah, that that region of AP is just really good. Maybe I'll start every battle with that. Just think, when I start a combat, I need to get that off. It'll effectively cost 60, which whatever. Alright, what's this way first? And then the rest of his company skills. Speaking of, it's been a hot tick since I've last looked through the skills. Urukai Bane. I got a feeling we'll be needing that soon. Like three times. A melee attack that cannot be countered. Not bad. Staying fast. Grants party immunity to all stunning effects. Not terrible. You have two allies and immediate free attack against a single target. That's actually pretty good. 25% less damage from spirit or spirit enhanced attacks. That's... Yep. Oh, okay. Uh, Gabarathor increases his action point pool. Yeah, let's do that one. That's not what I meant to do. You're not in the party. Stonehewa creates a damaging spirit attack. I'm going to guess of the earthy element. There are flame. We need to work on that. Lordly Might. Or ability to dodge. Now we're good with Lordly Might. I don't know what caused this to change. Or to upgrade. I can't complain. So yeah, I need to basically just spam the ever-loving crap out of craft. Which is better done against severely weaker enemies. Wounding strike is... Actually, wait. We'll let you learn Wounding Strike and then focus on Elven Rage, which is what I was initially looking into here. Right. Let's focus on Mountain Rage then. Because the Rage skills seem like they would be a lot better to dole out the damage. A lot faster. I don't know if this is progress or if this is... Oh. I think this is... I don't know. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, good. I faced the flames of Udun again. At least this time I'm a smidge stronger. I might want to just murder this thing. Not, not gonna lie. I think the the uh. All right, let's slow it. Slow his rate of attack. You son of a bitch. His dexterity might just be stupid high. God damn. Alright, what was this one? Group immunity just stun. Let's do company valor. You know, I could let some of my party go now. All right. Let's see about getting that attack rate lowered, shall we? Thank you. Was that the fellowship thing talking? I think it might have been. That one really wants my attention on Discord. 
Nope, not sure I like the helmet. Dwarven buckle of warrior iron. Epic scene first, I guess. Cleaning West Moria. Dominate goblins. Their chieftains must be defeated. The orc breed knows only fear and domination. It does not matter their size. Remember this lesson well, for there are much more powerful orcs upon your road. And some I hope you never encounter. We're gonna totally encounter that guy, aren't we? Oh, let's see. Finally, something to increase is... Okay. <laughs> Finally, something to increase his ace, his uh, armor class. Lowers everything else. What does he currently have on then? Oh, one to basically everything. Well, you got a new belt. Congratulations. Uh, a little bit of lumber spread. Alright, thinking on it again, probably don't want to use that with every the um AP region for every fight. Just just the ones that are more akin to boss fights. Oh god, you're all gonna go first? Cool. I think I can, I'll happily say that I think this fight should just end. Uh, so that I'll rage on this one. There we go. Don't have to worry about something if it's dead. Also, didn't realize he unstunned. Not complaining. Yeah, screw it. Water spirits all about. See if I can get to some of these. Cracked of Stone of Armor. Spoil, Elf Medicine. What I wanted to get more armor to, I suppose. You could actually benefit from some armor. Oh, wait, you've already got 144. I'm only a little salty about that, I'll have you know. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see... You. Which one dies? Any, mini money, you. God damn it. Ow. Also, ow. Good lord. Y'all can stop now. You know, it's a crying shame. I know that they probably do not count as orc. Despite the fact that they are, as far as I know, raised kind of akin to orc. Also, ow. Oh, damn it. Starting to run out of freaking AP for everyone. <clears throat> Guess not everyone. Critical goal here. Seriously, you can stop at that. Counterattacks. 
You jerks. I do find it interesting that you can't use any of the Healy stuff outside of combats. Well, at least the... Oh, at long been. Warven Shield of the Lords. Buster Moria. Now the Repic scene. Elf Dwarf Animosity. Hatred has existed between Elf and Dwarf for many ages. Long have I walked the forgotten paths of Middle Earth, and oft I studied the treasury of their past. Thousands of years ago, Elves fought in a last alliance with men, overthrowing the evil of Sauron. But their animosity towards Dwarves extends further back in time. None speak of deeds that divided them, but ancient distrust still burns in the hearts of both races. Have you heard nothing Lord Elrond has said? The ring must be destroyed. And I suppose you think you're the one to do it. You witness a rare thing, Gondorian. Elf and dwarf united in uneasy fellowship. But as you travel these lands, your small company faces the same old hatreds. Unite them, for the remaining treasures of Moria will not be surrendered without a fight. I do like treasure. I do like treasure. Um, let's see. I upped my spirit some, I can start getting more damage out of his fire attack. 40... I keep on wanting to make him stupid fast. But I think upping his strength would be best. For you... Spirit's already stupid high, so... Make it a little... A little bit, uh... Oh, God. Not yours, despite the fact that it was Dwarven. No, it was a shield, so... Let's see, a little bit more AP, a little bit more armor. Game straight. Alright. And... Minus one dex, minus one speed, but... Three strength is not bad. Even looks a little different. And Moria has not been kind when it comes to making it so as I can now save. I don't have the momentum to finish this fight fast as much as I would love to. Claw. Oh man. That hurts a lot. Cease that. No one fights a dwarf. Good grip. Citadel rage. I'm now at the point where I just gotta output a buttload of damage. Because they also output a buttload of damage. Good counter. Wonder what they're resistant against. Kinda no point in using the volley. All right. No one leveled. Always feels a little weird when no one levels. Guys, is there no save point in sight anywhere? <sighs> I'm gonna go ahead and call an episode at the least. When we return, we got more runes to collect before we can get through this place, which means a lot more fights, a lot more goblins, a lot more wards. And maybe at some point to Balrog. I don't know. We'll see.
Thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you're all enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And as always, I hope to see you folks in the next video. Take care. Cheers.